Welcome to What's New at IPC. This is our newsroom, where we usually work. Starting with the news. This Wednesday, uh, the Exploring Denmark class had the chance to visit the Louisiana Museum of Modern Art, and according to reliable sources, was well worth a visit. If you leave the school, you can go by bike if the weather is good, or by bus if you prefer. It's not just for the works of art that you should see the museum, but also for the setting. The view is splendid, especially on sunny days. The museum is definitely a must-see during your stay here. Then, last Wednesday fellowship, the students got informed about refugees and immigrants. We had two guests who talked about this situation. We got to learn about the life of a refugee and we had the chance to meet a stateless person without documents who described the challenges in her life that she has uh, had to cope with. This Tuesday, Bonnie went around the whole school to poke her head into everyone's room to do a room check. Most of the rooms and bathrooms were clean, but those who were not got a note saying clean the areas. This will happen once every three weeks to keep everyone in check, keep your area clean and avoid getting notes. Make it easy for Bonnie. At the Butterfly House, we enjoyed a warm and cozy bonfire by the lake just outside the UN Hall. The air was filled with the sweet scents of marshmallows roasting and we share snacks and candy while listening to music. Together, we crafted lanterns, creating a beautiful atmosphere under the stars. More than just an event, it was a time of connection. Sharing story, laughter, and getting to know each other better. It was truly a night to remember, filled with warm and new friendships. Thursday night, two of our teachers, Ang Hao and Julie, organized an educative session about USA election occurring the 5th of November. It was helpful for those people um, who wanted to know more about this event that could impact lives worldwide. That was the news for today. See you next time.